Alright guys, it's Nug Ninja again. So anyway, I got bored. So I figured, you know, what the hell. Um, <clears throat> I decided it was time to go on a mycological tour. Right? <clears throat> so my biggest job this time of year is commercial harvesting of wild, rare forest mushrooms. But, it just so happens, I live, like, I don't know, on 136 acres of riverfront cow fields. So, <clears throat> there's seven or eight good species you can pick in pasture land that are bomb. Right? I mean, as you can see, I can walk right out my back door, and within a few minutes, I can be just, like, mobbing around. But, <clears throat> anyway, I was sitting out in this cow field drinking coffee. And blam, I was like, fuck yeah, gonna have us some salad tonight. These are known as champignon, button mushroom. You can see the little babies spread out. The cattle really spread these around and these are the exact same mushroom that you get to put on your pizza that you buy at the grocery store. The only difference is, these aren't grown in caves. Same species, same everything. This is just their wild, natural, native environment. Now, these are super popular for urban mushroom pickers. I mean, it it's literally take this, chop it up, put it on a pizza. It's the same shit, you know. And I love these in salads, which I don't recommend. You know, it's always best, always best to cook any wild mushrooms you find <clears throat> because there is a slight risk for uh, like heartworms and such but uh yeah <clears throat> this is a really good mushroom here I've already picked a couple hundred pounds of chanterelles probably like 50 pounds of chicken of the woods now I'm wandering around I found these I'll pick these fresh maybe saute them up with some butter or something for dinner I don't know the possibilities are limitless but I always get pretty excited after my mushroom walks. I'm sure you've all noticed I get a little dramatic in my videos sometimes. Uh, it's usually after one of these long, exciting walks. I get all pumped up. You know, because there's just a multitude of species out here. It's so exciting. Hmm. What do you do? Anyway, it definitely cuts the boredom of trimming. I mean, I could just find species after species all day out here crazy well uh, now that the weed's almost down i'm probably gonna start my uh my mushroom adventures here soon picking wild rare exotic mushrooms all kinds of mushrooms thanks guys have a good one